Before we begin to discuss the types of lines, let's go over why would you have a line to begin with. A line, or also known as a central line or a CVL, central venous line, is used so that we can have permanent access to your blood system. So that we may administer IV fluids, IV nutrition, IV medications of any type, as well as sample your blood throughout your entire use of the line and treatment. There are two major types of lines. Those that are completely within the skin and you see no part of it outside of the skin and those that have a portion of it outside of the skin. They both do exactly the same thing but the only difference again is part of it is inside the skin and the other part isn't. The part that is completely contained within the skin is called a porticath whereas the type of line that has part of it out of the skin they are known by many different names but in children we most commonly call them a Broviac catheter. Ideally we will determine based off your child's age and underlying disease process what we think the best line would be for them. How is a central line placed? Whether we use completely implantable lines or lines that extrude from the skin they are placed exactly the same way. Generally we would access or enter a vein in the neck or underneath the collarbone by the shoulder once your child is asleep. At no time will your child be awake for this procedure. We then place the line again into a large vein in the neck of the chest and essentially measure the line using intraoperative x-ray machines to determine the precise length of the line and to confirm that there's no problems with placing the line. Once we're sure that the line is in adequate position using the intraoperative x-rays and that your child has suffered no problems intraoperatively or during surgery from the line placement, your child is awoken from anesthesia and then taken to the recovery room where he's allowed to wake up and to make sure that there are no other problems. Ideally, the line can be used immediately and any postoperative wound care instructions will be discussed at length with you by your health care provider. How is a central line removed? When it comes time for your child to have this line removed, your child will be seen and evaluated by an anesthesiologist who again will determine your child's suitability for surgery. The goal for this is your child again to not experience any pain or to have any traumatic problems in and around operative procedures. Your child will then go to the operating room and again have anesthesia. During anesthesia, either the entire porticath or the entire brobiac will be removed. We will go through old incisions and not make new incisions to remove these lines. All incisions will be sewn up. Special dressings called steri strips will be applied. And generally the steri strips would fall off in two to three weeks. Specific wound care instructions may also be given by your health care providers depending on your specific case. What about after surgery? After surgery, you can expect that your child will feel some soreness, pain, or tenderness in the areas of where the catheters were placed, especially the incisions. This tenderness is usually mild, self-limited, and usually resolves in a few days. Generally, it's treated with over-the-counter pain medications such as ibuprofen or Tylenol. And realistically, a mild narcotic may also be given to your child just in case he has too much pain. Special dressings will be applied during surgery to the incisions that should, be remain, should remain in place for several days. This ensures that the wound is not only clean and free of bacteria, but also prevents water from touching the wound. We'd also recommend that you don't allow your child to participate in any physical activity during this time period. And special wound, instru wound care instructions will be provided to you by your health care providers. Most importantly, realize that regardless of the type of line that's placed, it can be used immediately after surgery for whatever your child needs.